All right, assassins. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Tally Zora. Didn't even get to read your full name. <clears throat> Damn, I'm was that me? Contact. I'm such a badass. Don't worry, girl. I'll save you. Oh, okay. Okay. That's really... That's really immature. Did you just throw a grenade? Oh. <laughs> Ashley. <laughs> okay. Okay. Rex. Are you... What? Why can't I shoot? Overheat. Boy, I didn't even shoot anything. Ooh, level up. Assault... Assault... Assault rifles. And... I think I'm gonna go armor again. Cool. Now get up. Me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. <clears throat> yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about Fist. He got what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two things I need to thank you for. Who are you? Um, someone who just saved your life. Or I'm a friend. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe there. I want to see this anyway. All right. You're not making my life easy, <laughs> Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all-out assault on Cora's Den. Do you know how many? Who's this? A quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? This quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This yeah, and I do not accept your apology. Edge. So maybe we should just start at the beginning. Oh gosh. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. <sighs> Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile. The Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, Careful and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. Is that Saren? That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Saren won't get out of this one. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Don't tell me he was working with the captain. Do not tell me Eden that. Prime was a major victory. The beacon oh wait, what? <laughs> He's standing right down so stupid. The conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. See, I don't understand I why you didn't just play that in the first place. The talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. Uh... The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life, and they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. We have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tolly. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. Okay. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. 
Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Awesome. Wow. Um. See, I still want Ashley. And I think I'm gonna go Tolly. Tolly and Ashley. Or no, I think I want Rex. Because he's cool. Okay, I'm done. I don't even know why I'm bringing Ashley, to be honest. She does not talk at all. This place is a little too perfect. Like they're hiding something. And I'm sure I can romance um, Ashley and knowing Bioware, I can probably romance Tali. So where am I going now? Back to... Oh, that's a typo. That is a typo. And, okay, now I need to go back to the Citadel Tower. Open up. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? What do you want? Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh If this is a side quest, I'm not doing intrusion, it. But I have nowhere else to turn. A lot of people want my help these days. What makes you special? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. Wait, the 212? Your wife was serviceman Narali Bhatia. I'm Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams. I served in her unit. Chief Williams, it is a pleasure. Nirali spoke of you mm -hmm. with great respect. I'm bored. I'm so sorry for your loss, Mr. Batia. Nirali was a good woman. What can we do for you? I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. We'll look into it. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral. And the respect she deserves. See, the thing is, I don't want to spend too much time playing this game because I still got to get to Mass Effect 2 and 3. And if I'm going to do side quests in any of the games, it's going to be Mass Effect 3. So, I'm sorry. Sorry about, um... Yeah, sorry about your wife. There's nothing I'm gonna uh, do about it. <laughs> okay. Where is the tower? Where is the tower? Boom! This quick travel. Okay. That guy's up to something. What guy? Wait, what guy? Hmm. This guy? What? Whoa! Oh, no, I wasn't. Never mind. Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I'm going. <laughs> I'm out. Sorry, um, Chorbin. Chorban. Come on. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be they actually got convinced. Status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? 
Absolutely Only nothing. From the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using That's true. to bend the Geth to his will. <clears throat> I actually agree with him. But all these answer choices... 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in. Traverse. A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can take Saren down. Oh yeah, the I commander's can. commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No. It's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council, and it was a human who exposed him. Boom! This. Lay the hammer down. Speechless. <laughs> he actually, he's actually speechless. Commander Shepard, step forward. Yes, ma'am. That's right. That's right, a human is about to be a specter. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Okay, I'd like to, you know, I'd like to thank my mom. Um, Ashley, I'd like to thank her. And, uh, I'd like to give a big f fuck you to Caden, you know, just because he's a douche. I'm honored, Counselor. <coughs> I'm sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Mm, like my gun. I'll you know, find him. This to meeting his head. of the council is adjourned. Sweet. You know, I don't think I'm going to bring, bring Rex along. I'm, I'm going to bring We've got a lot of work to Ashley You're going and to maybe uh, Tolly. Supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy. And speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, I will do that. With me. Free I stuff is always a good time. <laughs> Bastard didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind you, Commander. Okay, awesome. Um, Spectre training. Sweet. Now let's just go two points in that. Wait, 
What does he mean to do? Damage and duration of powers and attacks. Accuracy. Okay, yep. We're going to in that. Fitness. Don't know when I unlock that. Combat armor. Alright, everything looks good. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go talk to the Spectre guy. No, no, no. We're gonna talk to the Spectre guy in the C something Academy. It's pretty sweet. Hey guys. Hey, Chorbin. I'm a Spectre now. Did you see? Oh, sorry about that. Okay, Presidium. I don't think that's the right place. Ward's locations, maybe. Uh, C sec. Okay. Requisition office. That is exactly where I need to go. Get some. Some loot. One sec. Looking you up. I'm a specter, you know, no big deal. Just the first human specter. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC requisitions officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, what? Commander Shepard? No. Show me what you've got. What? Am I not supposed to get my Sounds things? Good. Just let me set you Oh, up. yeah, here we go. I'm a specter. Well, must be a mistake. Systems telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare cool. stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. So I'm not actually getting anything for free. Which kind of sucks. Ooh. You know what? Why not? Why not just buy these things? Right, they're really cheap anyway. Yeah, let's get that. I don't even know what that does. Man, and uh. Don't know where that grenade thing went. But I guess I bought it. Okay. Let's get out of here. Talk to the ambassador. Don't even know where he is. Not sure where I'm supposed to go. Let's let's head back to the embassy, maybe, if that's even a place. Embassies. Okay, and it looks like I'm in the right the right spot. Hey, girl. Hey, I'm a specter. Yeah. You want me. Alright. Looks like it's this way. God, I love when doors open ju just open for you. Makes you feel special, but... I already know I'm special. Because, you know, I'm, in, I'm a specter. Where... The Wait, no! Wrong freaking place! Where... Where are you? Meet him at the Alliance Stocking Bay. Okay. Probably should have read that. Open up. Alliance Docking Bay. Whoa. Hmm. Ward's access, maybe? Okay, time to go on a little adventure and find the docking bay. Let's start in the lower words, I think. Oh, no, I didn't mean to go to CSEC. Maybe it's here anyway. Yeah, it is. Wow, I got lucky.
other news, ExogeniCorp is still denying reports that one of their survey teams has gone missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. When asked why communication with the survey team was suddenly cut off last week, company officials refused to comment. That's pretty suspicious if you ask me. Pretty suspicious. Alright, any day now. Any day now. Here we go. Everything just got brighter. Alright, Ambassador. What have you got for me? I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. About time. Old, old, quick and quiet, and old you know ass man. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Feed a well, Commander. This isn't right. The Normandy belongs That's to not you. what I meant to say. You needed your own ship. It belongs to me a now. Spectre can't okay. answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. Yeah, before I, I blast was in your, your head off. Twenty years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. What happened? I failed. I couldn't make the cut. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask Pathetic. Me whole story. For now, all you need to know is I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. Saren's not going to get away this time. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us Geth scouring the traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharaohs and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. Anything else? We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes How much in you want to bet she is going to be our love, last but it might be a good idea to try and find companion. Her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau cluster. Yeah, let's get let's go talk to her first. The Artemis Tau cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess, and I get stuck cleaning it up. I'll take care of Saren. You take care of the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a specter. And you were a douche long before you were to to an ambassador. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Awesome. Don't have any questions. No. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one first. Artemis Tau Cluster. Is the ship this way? Awesome. Right? Yeah. Let's go, guys. Let's get in the ship. I'm excited. Stand by shore party. Whoa. Contamination in progress. More like frame rate droppage in progress. Heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Saren's out there somewhere, and we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. Hundred percent. Intercom's open. If you got anything you want to say to the crew, now's the time. Listen up, Normandy. This is your commander speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. And I refuse to let anything get in the way of that mission. The Council wants to ignore this. That's no surprise. They've never helped us in the past. No reason they'd start now. But we don't need their help. We can do this on our own. Our enemy knows we're coming. When we go into the Traverse, Saren's followers will be waiting for us. But we'll be ready for them, too. None of the other species has the guts, grit, or balls to deal with this. So it's up to us. We're the only ones who can stop Saren. <laughs> I swear to no you offense, all, we uh, will Rex stop him. and Garrus. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. 
The captain's not here. That's not what I'm I meant to say. Here, Joker, I meant to say the middle option. Bird in the air. Yes, sir. Okay. Awesome. So we're back here where we started. And Galaxy map. I'm assuming that's where I choose where to go and I'm going to go to the Artemis Tau and find this girl. Let's do it. 